Welcome to this tutorial on the JIT's portal, a simple and easy way to apply for financial assistance to your JIT. All you need is a computer, an email address, and you can make your own personal account. Let's get started. To navigate to the JIT's portal, simply access the Eurojust website click on Joint Investigation Teams, then apply via JITS portal. And here you are. From here creating an account is easy. You simply click on Create New JIT Account and fill in the form that appears. Here you fill in the text from the capture image to prove you are a real person, read, accept the terms of use and click register. You should immediately receive an email with a temporary password which you can use to log in for the first time. You will then be asked to change this password to one of your choice. And there you have it, your own personal JITS portal account. Now you're ready to start applying for funding. To log into your account, simply access the login page of the portal and click Log in to your JIT account. Insert your email address and password. And as I'm sure you've worked out already, click Sign in. Now let's just take a minute to familiarise ourselves with where to find things. At the top of the page, you will see various links to the Eurojust website. For example, here you will find the latest call for proposals. If you no longer wish to have an account, you can click on Remove Account and Eurojust will delete it for you. You can sign out of your account here at the top left hand corner of the page. To access any draft applications click either Edit Draft Application or Funding Applications. Here you can access and edit existing drafts which are stored in the portal for two months. You can also see a summary of any applications you have submitted in the past. However, you cannot retrieve a copy of the applications themselves. Now I'm sure the part you're most interested in is how to apply. Two options, click here or here to start a new funding application. What you now have in front of you is a simple online form. All you need to do is fill in all the relevant fields. Most are pretty intuitive, like free text fields and drop-down menus, but fields such as 1.5 perhaps need a quick demonstration. Here, you click on the plus sign to add a new row. Fill in the relevant information. and click Confirm. To alter or delete a row, simply click to highlight it, and then choose the Edit symbol or the Delete symbol. A good thing to do as you are drafting your application is to regularly save your work. You can do this by clicking Save Draft at the top of the form. As mentioned before, drafts are kept in your account for two months. If you want to share a copy of your draft application, you can simply click on Export to Word, save the file to your computer, and share it with your fellow JIT members. Now let's speed things up.
So, you filled in all the relevant fields of the form, and now you come to the section for attachments. To add an attachment, for example your JIT agreement, click Browse, search for and select a file you want to attach, click Open, then click on the button Upload, and there it is. Now the final step. It's time to submit your completed application. Simply read and accept the terms and conditions and click on the Submit button. You will only be able to submit your form if there is an open call for proposals and your form contains no errors. At this point, you will be prompted to save a copy of your application. This will download a so-called zip file containing both a PDF and a Word version of your application, which you can save on your computer. So, you have submitted your application. What comes next? Well, Eurojust does an initial screening and allocates a reference number to your application. Then, you receive an email with the reference number and the date by which you will know if your application has been successful. So that's it. A simple and easy way to request financial assistance from Eurojust. Remember, if you have any questions, you're welcome to email us at jits at eurojust.europa.eu and bye for now. <laughs>